Good morning, y'all. Welcome back to another vlog. I am back from my trip. It's Tuesday. I didn't vlog yesterday, but we're getting back into things today. I have very exciting, exciting. I have very exciting news to share with y'all in the backyard. So while I was gone, they built the deck, and it looks amazing. Like. It is exactly what I pictured. It's getting painted today, so we're actually gonna go to the Home Depot this morning. I don't wanna talk about the grass right now. It's a really sensitive subject. All my grass has died. I've been having so much, pro so many problems with my sprinkler system. Um, I don't even know why that stone is there and why there's just, why they put all dirt there. I don't know, I had a landscaper come out yesterday. He's coming back this week, so. Anyways, this is looking amazing. It's like once one thing is, happens, you know, the rest of them fall apart, so. That is getting finished, and then my chairs are arriving. I have no idea how I'm going to lift them up there. That's going to be interesting. Um, yeah, lots of, lots of updates. I'm very excited. Do y'all get tired of my vlogs being like literally the same thing every, oh, oops, every single day? It's like I'm watering the plants, I'm at home, I'm whatever, but you know what? Fall's coming up and we're going to have some better things, okay? But let me know because like I can change it up maybe. I can do like a theme or like, I don't know, I'm not really like a theme sort of girl, so you guys keep me posted. Um, so I just made some coffee. Coco has Accu at 10. And then I'm gonna go to Home Depot to pick out my pink colors. And then we've got work to do. At this point, you guys already know about a friend of mine, my new brand, I'm pretty positive, definitely. Um, so I've been working on that all week. This is actually launch week for it, as I'm, of course you guys know. I don't, I don't know, there's something, something wrong with me. So I have everything pretty much done. I just need to edit a couple more TikToks and things like that, but I'm like pretty much good to go. So excited. So anyway, it's gonna be a good old week of my life at home. Lots happening. I'm gonna make like a summer soup. That's what I'm feeling today, which doesn't really feel like it fits, but I'm gonna make it fit. Last night we started this puzzle. Macy came over and then her friend Tabby is also my friend now, but um, it is the cutest puzzle ever. And it, honestly, it was so funny. Like we were so serious taking this so seriously. I hope they come back today because I will be doing this with or without them. Um, it's a piecework puzzle. I got it on Amazon. I, they used to be at like Anthropology and stuff. I will add it to my Amazon storefront, but they just have really cute puzzles like this. And it's honestly a really fun, wholesome um, activity. I know that everyone has done a puzzle in their life, but like, have you done a puzzle in your 20s? Probably not, okay? Okay, I just dropped coconut off. I am on my way to Home Depot. I'm really living my like suburban mom, housewife, morning so the color that i like the most that my mom and i decided on is actually a stain and we need to paint the deck and by we i mean my brother-in-law is painting it so i'm gonna go to home depot and hope to god they just match it growing up i used to hate going to home depot and now it's like my favorite place to be home depot or lowe's the plant section early morning might i add like it just does something to me it really does I got my first pumpkin cream cold brew of the season and I swear to god these five sips that I've had have done more for my mental health than like months of therapy I'm not kidding like oh my god like something happened to me I'm just so happy time for a haul from Princess Polly I have been shopping there for years as you guys know honestly a large large majority of my closet is from Princess Polly specifically my dresses Working with them again, I'm so excited. I place my own orders all the time. I actually use my own code. Okay, so my code is on the screen and it's 20% off site-wide. It is my go-to for shopping, honestly. And they have really fast shipping, so that's another reason. Like, if you need something for that weekend, I'm constantly, like, placing orders. So, thank you to Princess Polly for sponsoring today's video. Okay, I feel like the lighting could be better. It ships from within the U.S. and they have free standard shipping, so that's 36 business days if you spend over $50, which is, like, amazing. It's my go-to for, honestly, anything. I'm constantly ordering from them. So, anyways, we have another haul, but this time it's going to be, like, a fall haul. And you might look at my pieces and be like, what? Keep in mind that it's still hot in Texas, so this is my fall haul. I'm just, like, I'm just prepping. They're more, like, transitional outfits. It's not, like, actually fall, you know? This dress is so cute. I will obviously be wearing this with cowboy boots. Um, I don't know which ones. I could obviously I can wear any because it's white. I think I'm gonna wear it this weekend to a football game, but 
it is perfect like this is just the perfect white dress also also strapless dresses are just hard in general because i feel like they never stay up but this one is so i like love this dress okay like just guys that is really really cute this dress is so cute and flattering also very colorful for me or a color i don't really normally wear um but i think it's really good for fall i don't even have it zipped up all the way in the back because i need help with that but it's really really flattering like this is so cute i love their dresses that's what i'm saying like i'm constantly getting dresses from them okay this dress is like a really wholesome dress that you wear to like meet your boyfriend's family or something but it's also so comfortable i like having dresses i feel like the lighting might be better this way i like having dresses like this because if you're ever feeling like you know when you just like feel so uncomfortable and you're just like not feeling well and just like want to be comfortable but you want to wear a dress this is the one it is so comfy okay moving on to this dress this is like if i'm going out out i wouldn't wear the shoes that i'm wearing with it now just wanted to give it a little bit of a heel so i have this dress in blue and i loved it so much that i obviously needed to get it in my favorite color but it's kind of just perfect i don't know where i'm gonna wear this to like i've gotta gotta find something but i love it it's just perfect okay this dress is also really cute with boots i thought it was gonna be too short but it's not at all um i love like the detailing it's just kind of perfect i love anything with a bow these days this is like such a cute white shirt it's actually perfect i might even wear this this weekend i don't know i love this i love anything with a bow i did get my lip gloss on it but like I always do that. Okay, I accidentally unzipped this fully, so I need someone to help me. But another perfect white top. I feel like I just never have enough good tops for, honestly, everything. Not even just for going out, like, day to day. Just, like, a cute top. I feel like all of my stuff is so basic, and this is, like, classic, but also cute and just fun. Again, bows. This shirt is perfect. Just a cute little pink top. I love this. Again bows on everything but this is amazing i think i'm actually gonna wear this today we'll see but it's perfect okay but honestly like this shirt is it this is amazing it looks like so high quality it like snatches you in i mean it is high quality but it looks like a very like rich top is what i'm saying okay this is perfect got the princess poly code it is shop kenzie's I'll have a link below. They also offer afterpay and shop pay to all US customers. I love their stuff. I'll be wearing it all weekend long. This top is literally perfect. That concludes our Princess Polly haul. I will be doing one, I'm sure, in the next month. Guys, I got this stain. I actually can do stain. False alarm. We have some deck drama. Um, also, it turns out that I can't even actually have it painted yet because what is it called? the seal or something on it the back of the wood is green it needs to sit they said at home depot 90 days but the guys who built my deck and like do this for a living are like no we can do it next week um and my brother-in-law is not actually doing it he just like set me up with these people so anyways long story short the deck will be done next week my furniture does arrive tomorrow anyways um oh yeah since i've become such a hack girl my life has changed like it really has like this is just the way to live your life you don't have to do your hair it looks cute I like it um I'm wearing this one right now I have hats I'll just show you guys in the vlog because I already put an order in so hopefully they'll be coming out soon I have this hat for a friend of mine that I didn't want to wear just yet um, because I can't post it right now and I'm posting today obviously on social media um, but the vlog doesn't matter so anyways look at how cute it is I'm gonna wear it now because I have, oh hello, I'm filming a little brand deal actually with Fitz and we're going to do a nice little checkup. It's going to be so fun. He's really having a day out on the town. My pumpkin cream cold brew, like something happened. I just, something happened in me. Like I'm just like a new woman, you know? So anyways, I need to put these, is this bad to put? No, these are fine to put in the garage, I think. I don't really know. Also, I have decided that I'm gonna redo um, my guest bedroom and like it have it let be less of a guest bedroom and more of an office. But I'm also gonna have like a day bed and like a trundle, so like there's still room for guests. Just because I would use an office like every day, I'm not using a guest room every day. Even though I do use a guest room a ton, 
whatever it gives me like more of an option like i can make that room more of like a flex room if you will i've never used that word before in my life so one second i'm gonna go put these in the garage i'm back so i'm using sierra again who is who designed my little front room in there um i have her tagged on like my instagram my tiktok and stuff she's great and i told her what i wanted last week and she's already sent me so many options so i want to go through that today and actually order everything and then just work on selling stuff on facebook marketplace like the bed's gotta go and i love that bed i'm just gonna sell the whole thing just be like if you can just like get this out of my house it's yours no i should still that's my problem with facebook marketplace i put things are free because i just want it like gone um and like there's stuff i have forever like i don't know i should be selling them but then like you get too many messages you know so anyways i'm gonna do that and do the tv and then get ready because i'm gonna have to do wallpaper in there i'm doing a whole room of wallpaper which is what i wanted but i need to decide on like my laptop maybe i'll do that on tiktok today and have people help me i don't know um but i have my recipe journal this is still a sample I'll probably go next week to grab some things. Um, it's just the cutest thing ever. So anyways, I'm making new recipes tonight. I don't even know if I'm going to go to Sprouts. I might just like DoorDash all my groceries and figure that one out. But anyways, this hat, it's cute, right, guys? It's a little corduroy embroidered. That's like chocolate brown, but it kind of, yeah, it actually does look chocolate brown. The other samples, it looks more black, but I wanted chocolate brown. I am also, I'm working on other hats. Just because, this is like so perfect. I loved hats before, but like, something has gotten into me. Anyways, can you tell I have a lot of energy? And then I'm very happy. It's the pumpkin cream cold brew. I'm back home, I got another hat. This is just waiting for me in the mail. Um, it's from Not From Malibu, y'all can use code KENZY15 for 15% off, isn't it cute? Anyways, I have been sitting here um, procrastinating getting work done and instead buying all new furniture for my new room. Um, I have gone completely out of control, so I just ordered all of the furniture. So it's all the wallpaper, all the things. So she gave me two options. I'm working with Sierra Belonga, as I said earlier, and she gave me two, well, she gave me three options. She's the best, by the way, if y'all are looking to hire someone. She's amazing. You can hire her virtually or in person in New York if you guys live there. Okay, so these are the options. It was this and then this. So I got this. I like kind of combined it all, right? So I did that mirror, that rug, that bedding, that bed, those bulletin boards, that um, wallpaper, that lamp, and then this desk situation. So I'm very excited. Most of it's actually arriving in the next like week or so. It's very quick. So now I'm on Facebook Marketplace trying to get people to come buy or pick up my furniture. Um, and hoping that happens very soon so I can have that out and then have my um, wallpaper, which is just peel and stuff this time. So it's going to be easier and cheaper. Um, but yeah, I'm very excited for this room, even though I'm such, every time I make an office, I never use it. But I really just more than anything need, especially with the new brand, I need somewhere to put actual physical product and to just have stuff. I'm like a really big like work at the kitchen table girl. I don't really want to be i would like to have that space and regardless it's still going to be a guest room so like it doesn't really matter it's just like a little bit more useful i'm very excited about that um, i have groceries being delivered and i am about to write down a new recipe in my recipe book my recipe journal because because i hate having extra technology in the kitchen when it doesn't need to be there so Starting to cook, it's just so peaceful. I've got the candles going, I've got music playing, I'm my recipe journal out. I'm making vineyard chicken, it actually looks really good, so I'll keep you guys posted. Guys, Macy is making a music video tonight. Do you wanna fill them in on your, oh, be careful. Do you wanna fill them in on your plans? Hey guys. Um, wait, one sec. Is it a song? Oh, sorry, okay. Um, yeah, I'm making a music video tonight. If you guys don't follow me on TikTok, I've been really exploring more of like my dancing and musical side, and I think oh. I'm gonna get into music videos. So that is what I'm doing tonight. It's to a song called. Hold on. Pretty hungover. It's a brand deal. <laughs> it's pretty hungover. Thirteen. It's called Pretty Hungover. 
Oh, Jay has like my shirt. Yeah, she came over our matching. Um, yeah, so she's gonna, she has her song ready to go. Wait, really quick. Oh. It used to be so, uh, Young, Miley's new song. There's a part where I really want to learn pirouettes when the beat drops. Okay. I know I used to be young. And I just need someone to teach me pirouettes. So if someone's in Dallas and can do that, well, I'm sure that there's gonna be okay. someone. Okay. Like it's just a quick We've got a lot of Dallas there. girls, so I'm sure. If I could learn how to pirouette, It'd be game be, over. Be game over. Maybe I should put that on my Instagram story. Can someone in Dallas teach me how to pirouette? What are we making? Yeah. Oh wow, it's already been 15 minutes. What, what are we making? This vineyard chicken, it's gonna be really good. Like, what am I doing? Yeah, I forgot. Yeah, I thought it was supposed to be two. <laughs> good. But just like one big one. So. It smells so good. I figured you were gonna get that. Oh! What? what kind of tomatoes are those? They're grapes. Are we gonna put on sourdough? Yeah, we have crotta and sourdough. It's gonna be really good, I'm telling you. So anyways, Macy came over and she brought props. They're gonna be so happy when they see this. I know. She's doing it as a gift, if you will. A gift, yes. For her newfound friendship. For my new it's friend. Huge. Oh wait, I think I need to broil this. What do you hope your audience's reaction is to this music video? Don't burn yourself. Okay. You're skinny. I hope that they, I just continue to receive the support that I've been getting. Totally. It's, oh my god, those are actual grapes. I know. What, what did you think they were? I think they're like great tomatoes. Like, I don't no. know. Allow to rest for five minutes. Okay, this literally drives me insane. What I'm confused about, okay. I was like on the phone when I was cutting the shallots and I cut them so weird. So I reckon I'm gonna be playing for the app, but it's fine. I have the basis. You do? Did you want to like? I took like, an intermediate dance class in seventh grade with Mrs. Tuchek. Cause oh, Tuchek that's class huge. Year, junior high. Okay, the shirt's kind of like restricting my movement. Mm. Ooh, that's good. Okay, cause I learned like the step in like a while ago. Okay. Oh, Missy, you're just getting better. That was better. double. No, you're just getting better and better. That's it's going straight to my crazy. head. That was insane, actually. No, <laughs> it's like kind of crazy. Can, that, can Carly be? Like loop that. And oh yeah, Carly, can you loop that and then we'll like that double, like just like totally. on repeat. Like it's not like a baby's first steps; it's like Macy's first pirouette. No, totally. This is gonna be enough food because we'll have the toaster ricotta. Oh, don't worry. But it's because in butcher's box, sometimes it's two and sometimes it's one. So I thought I thought that. Don't even worry about it, girl. Like don't. Even, like I'm so chill. Like, I'm so go. So girl. chill. Yeah, I didn't really get that vibe from you. Oh, what's this week's podcast episode on? Um, it's the one with Liz Woods, pop culture. Oh, Scooter Braun. Oh, Can't do you guys talk one. about SB Spider Boy Scooter Braun? Spider Boy and Karma. Yeah. Basically, that's what we did. Spider Boy. Okay. Well, it's been real, so we have to go. Okay, guys, dinner is done. Macy's already had some, and so it's great. Looks good. Good morning, y'all. I'm back in my car. It is now Wednesday. Um, I'm actually on my way back to Modern Animal. I don't even know if I talked about this yesterday in the vlog. I either talked about it for five minutes or I didn't at all. I'm doing a deal with them because it is open in Dallas on TikTok. And I was like unbelievably impressed that I already moved Coconut, made her a member, and now we're on our way to her appointment there. Um, and they're just amazing if y'all are in Dallas. Or like they have a bunch of different locations in like different cities, but it's really sick. Just watch my TikTok that is up right now. But anyways, I worked out this morning. I stayed up so late last night. Macy and I were filming a music video. Um, and then I just stayed up so late until like 2.30 and I'm so tired. But a lot is on the agenda today. I've got to finalize some more stuff for a friend of mine. I need, oh, my uh, furniture is supposed to arrive from article, but I haven't gotten a call since last week. So now I'm just kind of like worried. I don't know if it's coming or not. Um, and I don't know if I updated y'all on this, but I can't get my deck stained. I can't get it stained, but I can't get it stained until next week. So that's actually, I definitely did tell you guys that. Like what?
Y'all, I should have like two more chairs, honestly. At least one more chair, I think I do three up here. It's a lot, but there's definitely room. And I'm gonna get little like tables, I think. I do wanna get an umbrella. I feel like that's a good idea, but also it's kind of shaded, so maybe I won't. I don't know, the wood is getting treated next week, so ignore how this looks. But the chairs themselves are stunning. You know what I could also do though? Just move these to a corner put a table in and then just add some like flowers or something on the corner so it feels more full. You know what I mean? I feel like that might be more of the vibe before I buy another chair. I also think these are on back order until January because like right after I ordered them, they were on back order. So we'll see. Just let me know what you guys think below. There's, like, if I line them up, I think four is too much, but three is really kind of the perfect amount. It's gonna look so much better once it's stained, but lots of progress has been made. Currently filling up the pool, I was cleaning it earlier. This setup is so ideal. I'm about to play music. I'm in the pool, but I'm working. Like, this is incredible, guys. And, hello, it's me. I put my braids up in my hat. Um, I have people coming tonight to get at least one of the tables, hopefully the rest of the stuff in my um, second bedroom, or the guest bedroom, or the office or whatever, so that I can start on that. I ordered all this stuff yesterday, so. We got a lot of, like, home updates in this vlog. I'm hoping that um, me being in the pool right now takes off all the rest of my tanner and I can scrub that off tonight. Like we've got a lot of moving parts. I am back outside to work. I just watched Gals on the Go and Nantucket um, episode, but I just went in and showered, self-tanned. I have my spring clothes being worked on and then some furniture being picked up, um, but I'm gonna work on a bunch of stuff for launch and just whatever edits and stuff. I've been getting this salad so much. I know I've already vlogged it, but the strawberry whatever salad from Mendocino Farms, it is so good. Good morning, y'all. Happy Thursday. I can't believe it's already Thursday. So I had the best time. Actually, I have a question. So with the pool, there's more mosquitoes in my backyard at dawn and at dusk because that's when it attracts mosquitoes apparently. Um, I just growing up in Texas was so used to mosquitoes always being there, so I didn't realize that there were specific times because they just always come to me. I'm also allergic, so every time I get a bite, it's like horrible. Like my legs growing up were just really, really tragic. Anyways, what should I do? What should I do? Like I have a, like a candle on my like dining table outside. I don't necessarily want to get my whole, I don't, like, I feel like we have those, like, things on our fences that sprayed for mosquitoes growing up, but I feel like those are maybe expensive or, like, more money than, like, I want to put down. What should I do? What should I do? Oh, I guess I could wear those mosquito bracelets, too. I don't know how much good that would do, because I'm by the water. Anyways, um, it's Thursday. Tonight we're going to the Whip. I was supposed to go like a month ago to the opening because the Whip is the whippersnapper in Dallas, my favorite bar. It's, I don't know how to describe it because like I'm like a dive bar girl and it's like a dive bar almost like club. And I'm only saying that because there's tables and a lot of dancing, but it's so casual. And like I never go before midnight because like that's when you have to go. And it is the most fun place ever. That's where we got a table after my show. It's where we go to like birthdays. Like we'll just, we go honestly like quite often. Um, and it's just so much fun. So anyways, they they have themes always and right now it's Barbie I was supposed to go to the opening, but Lauren and I are gonna go and I think we both got sick or something Anyways, they mattered us then so we're going tonight We're going at literally 6 p.m. to the whip for dinner and drinks, but it's because I'm making a TikTok. Um, but if you guys are in Dallas, you'll understand that that's like crazy <sighs> It's like not a restaurant. It's a bar I have my coffee. I'm on my way to Pilates um I just am so obsessed with my backyard. And, oh my god, guys. Okay, so I ordered all that new furniture. This is really a, a house vlog. Also, I've been saying this is launch week. Technically, it is because I'm launching the brand tomorrow, but I'm not launching product until next week. So really, next week is launch week. Anyways, I ordered a new um, daybed from Wayfair like two nights ago, and I accidentally sent it to my old address in LA somehow, and it got delivered yesterday already. So then I was like, oh, there's nothing I can do. I messed it up. So I ordered another one in my house last night and it's already, I think it's being delivered today. Crazy, so my table got picked up last night and then I have a bed that's getting picked up today. I really don't wanna part ways with my love sack. 
Like, I just am refusing, so I'm just gonna put that in the garage until I realize that, like, it really is time. But I don't even think it is time, because, like, I bring it out to entertain, so I think I really am gonna keep it. And if anything, I'll give it to, like, Lauren or someone. I'm not gonna, like, get rid of it, because I want to keep it, keep it close, you know? Um, but a lot of this stuff is already arriving for the roommates. I was picturing this to take a couple months. I honestly think it's gonna be done in the next couple of weeks. So, lots of home updates. I'm back from Pilates and showered. I like can't take myself seriously. Um, my hair is really messed up from the braids all week. I'm gonna put a hat on soon, ignore this. But I'm getting a lot of questions about skincare that I've been using lately. And I think people are seeing my like no makeup makeup and thinking it's the same thing too. Anyways, the only skincare that I'm actually using is Primal Leap here. I use the serums. Normally use a plumbing serum. I have a bunch. I like have this one breakout because I forgot um, face cleanser in New York and I used like body cleanser. Like I had to. Really, really low point. Um, so, anyways, for skincare, I literally just use Primal Leap here. That's and then I use Super Cute for sunscreen every day. Um, I've been using their bombs too, which I'm not gonna share. I don't think they're out yet. I don't know if I'm allowed to, but I'm posting about them on Instagram. Anyways, love their stuff. Um, you guys can use code Kenzie or Kenzie for fifteen percent off. I do work with them, but um, like when I'm I'm re the one repurchasing it, I'm the one who's doing it. So like I've worked with them in the past. I'm working with them on like an Instagram story or something. It has literally nothing to do with that. Like they're we're only working together so much because I genuinely use the product so much. So um, it's also like non-toxic. It's really good for you. It's just like better ingredients. It's very like I don't know. It's just better. Um, another random thing that I want to do now. This Kapari, what is it? The Golden Aura Body Oil is the best body oil I have ever used. Like one thing about me, I love an oil. Like look at the difference. It's really lightweight. I feel like oils can get really messy. I don't feel that way about this one. I will link it below. It smells so good, like unreal. So anyways, I've shown you guys this makeup routine. I'm gonna show again just really quick because we're here um, and I've been getting comments about it. So I only really use, I guess, four products. Makeup by Mario on everything and then an eyebrow gel, I actually hate this eyebrow gel. I wanna try the Rare Beauty one. Um, you know what, I actually got a Sephora shipment in today. I can't remember if um, I was able to get that or not, but I'm gonna try out a new, like, better makeup look tonight when I go to the whip for dinner at 6 p.m. Like, imagine, for those who like don't understand how funny that is, like, imagine going to like, I don't know, it's not like a club. I, I really can't compare it to anything. Um, but like a casual club at 6 p.m. is like, I guess, but it's not a club. Anyways, I first go in with the Skin Transforming Skin Protector. It's just a powder. I put it all over my face. Next, I go in with the Soft, Soft Sculpt Transforming Skin Enhancer. It just makes you look like really glowy and like natural. Like it's super, super natural looking. This is honestly like my favorite thing ever. Then I go with the Makeup by Mario. This is a really bright pink blush, poppy pink. I don't think this is the right. We're gonna use it, I don't think it's the right. No, I actually have been using this. This brush is also Makeup by Mario. Um, and I put like a lot of blush on because I kind of want to look sunburnt, but I love blush. And then that is it, like seriously. That's all. And then I put a lip product on, which makes you look obviously a lot more put together. Here's my hat. I have another one today. This has become my entire personality. Like, how? Anyways, I'm gonna go to at home to pick up some pots. Um, by the way, this is like a better look of the makeup. You guys will just see it throughout the vlog. My bathroom is really cluttered right now, and like I don't do well with this, so I'm gonna declutter today. I just have too many products. And like, if I don't use it every day, it's got to go. I also, like, I don't know, I still, I really need to declutter. I've been thinking about that. I need to go through my other closet just because pretty soon I'll be switching out my fall clothes for my summer clothes and switching the closets like in my closet room. So anyways, very exciting. I'm gonna go to at home and get pots. And then I have to take Coco to an appointment. Again, she's at an appointment every day this week. Um, and then I'm gonna go to Home Depot during her appointment and get plants. I think we're gonna do mums just because moms do well here this time of year and I still need moms for out there to fix that. Like I have a lot. Okay, 
I am in another hat. I'm on my way to at home. I am so excited. This is like such an ideal morning, but it's only 80 degrees out right now. It was 70 earlier. The mornings have been so nice. Even yesterday was nice. I'm getting a little bit confused because like since when does this happen in Texas in August? There are pots that I saw. I probably showed y'all when I was at, at home like a month ago. Um, there were pots there that I really wanted and I think, I don't know, I'm gonna start with just some to put in the corners and then go from there. I don't think I'm gonna do, well, wait, didn't I buy the box? No, I didn't. I don't think I did. Anyways, we're gonna see. I don't think I'm gonna get like a long planter. People are saying doing it on the back, but I like being able to like move and walk around that. So I don't think I'm gonna do that, but I do think I'm gonna do ones in the corner so we'll see and we're doing mums i've decided because mums actually stay alive okay it's like zinnias and mums are like the only thing that stay alive my favorite place to be truly i keep changing the colors but this is like the material i guess that i want they have a bunch of different colors but I want one more that matches the size but isn't as big as the biggest. The other colors have like a shorter round one. They just don't have all the colors and the sizes that I want. So I've got to figure it out. But like this at least is like a start, you know? This is like perfect. It looks so much nicer. At home has the best planters. This is the other size and I feel like it's too big. Um, so I don't know. Like obviously I have a lot of space so it could take up space and look good but it's just really big. I wish it was like, I don't know, a little bit smaller. Those are massive. But even then, this is only $80, and again, this would be like $600 somewhere. Y'all are hosting any like Halloween things? These are actually cute. Someone is like, so much like holiday decor is tacky, but cute. Picking up my first fall candle. It smells so good. Not only does it feel amazing outside today, like I could sit here, forever. Um, I just got these two pots and that candle for $50 because they're having a sale. So I'll be back. That's like an insane deal on pots. Pots are like rugs. They're so expensive and like why, you know? This is honestly like such a stunning view. So I got five mugs. The mums are out, therefore fall is here. I need to get a pumpkin cream cold brew. So all of those with um, four bags of potty mix, which I might need more depending on the size because I don't have the right like uh, divider, I guess, for the pot. All of those were like $100. It just is really feeling like fall. I'm so happy. This is why I need a truck. Okay, I just dropped everything off at home, but obviously the plants that died in this heat, those are gonna be mums. And then the other two plants are also gonna be mums, but I'm wondering if I should have gotten for this. I might have to stop by on my way home because this is not enough. Oh, that's what I was worried about. No, I feel like it's fine. It's gonna grow into it. It'll be okay. Two is too many. I don't think I can even do that, so. Anyways, this is what our afternoon is gonna look like. I just love being home. Like being back into my routine, my nice morning routine. Love when it's becoming fall and I'm happy again and like everything is just better. But I need to change. I, I don't know who I was kidding. Like this is not what I need to be wearing today if I'm going to be doing plants. So I'm going to go change. This right now, well first off, okay, back home. But this is a huge moment because I'm lighting. Okay, my first. Oh, what was that? Fall candle of the season, okay? I've just been in the absolute best mood this week. Like, I'm singing in the car, I'm so happy, like, oh my God, and I swear to God, it's because I know fall is coming and also the weather's amazing. Macy's been texting me, like, every hour, I mean, like, what is this? I'm, it's just, I just don't know. I don't wanna get too ahead of myself, but like, it feels amazing. So, anyways, my bed is getting picked up. That one in there, just a symbol that picked up today. In like an hour, and then my Wayfair bag that I told you guys about that I ordered again, that I ordered the wrong one, I ordered again, literally is already arrived. It's outside my house, so 
I actually think I'm gonna have that um, bed built. Like I'll hire like a task rabbit or something, just because like if I build something, it's gonna fall, it's gonna break. There's just no point in me doing that. So know your strengths, you know? Also, very, very exciting news guys. I finally got a Galicia Farms partnership, okay? I honestly wasn't even doing any of those postings for that, but hey, I'll take it, okay? There is no one who loves that brand more than I do. They're doing like a smoothie king thing. So very exciting. Um, when you guys see that, I need every single person to comment and uh, just be very happy because listen, it's cookie butter creamer, it's huge. Okay, so we're gonna start on the plants, I think. I need to sort of message these people. Um, Coco's appointments, like while yes, it is annoying that I have to drive almost like three times a week and then just sit there and it's like 30 minutes away. It's kind of nice because I actually get so much done that I like put, you know like the tedious things on your to-do list that you just like put off. You're like, I don't want to do that. And then you just like ignore it every day. I'm actually really getting all that done because like I have nothing to do but sit in my car for an hour. So that's been good. Okay, it's actually looking amazing back here. So I forgot I actually did buy that planter. See, I thought I bought something. Couldn't remember, it's so small. I don't even know where I'll put it. If I even will, what I'll do with it. Let me know in the comments below. But I put these mums in the corner. So at least hopefully they won't die because they get so much shade. I have a center table coming. And then I ordered a umbrella from Article. Um, and it's on back order for I think like two months. So. It'll get here eventually. It was just like the best. I was obsessed with it. I just love their outdoor furniture. Like, this is so good. Not sponsored, I wish. Would have loved for this to be sponsored. Um, but anyways, it looks really good. I don't know if I'm gonna add anything else until I have, you know, it stained and the stuff up here. I feel like less is more, it looks good. Let me know what you guys think about that little planner over there. Should I just not use it? I don't know. I have a fire pit too. This is crazy because I'm like really getting rid of the grass, but I have a fire pit that I was gonna move over here um, for the fall and winter time and then just like put chairs around it. Just do like some stone underneath it. Um, let me know what y'all think. I feel like that's just so good for entertaining and like fall and winter time. But I do have that other space up there. My garden is gonna be, this is all from the sprinklers that are getting fixed right now. Uh, my garden's gonna be all this back here, which is nice because it actually is shaded as you guys can see. It's not the most stunning area, but it's gonna be great for a garden. So anyways, this is literally like a dream backyard. I just want my grass to not look like this. All right, I just got this sample in and this is actually a merch sample. This is gonna be very confusing because I'm launching a new brand and we are gonna do Texas hats like in the this end of this year, I think. But this is from the merch, the shirts that I came out with that you guys have seen. I don't know what is with me in hats right now, but I love it. What do you guys think? It says, find me in Texas. I love the camo. I think it's super fun. Just let me know what you think. And is it so confusing to have it under different branches? You know what I mean? I don't know. Okay, so I'm going to the Barbie event. Another thing is that I really need to replace this rug. Okay, I don't know who's at my door, but we're gonna ignore it. Um, I also, when I made that order and I ordered it to the wrong address, I ordered a new light for in here. So I'm hoping that I didn't lose that too. I did cancel it. I don't know if it just has cancellation pending, but anyways, this is, my look, I just grabbed a bunch of pink things from my closet, which is very easy because my closet is pink. It's either brown or pink, basically. Um, and I just threw my hair up, it's so gross right now. <sighs> just as I put a lot of like hair oil in, whatever. What am I, I'm getting a blow in the morning, so it doesn't even matter. My St. Laurent bag that honestly, I do not recommend buying because I barely wear it. I thought I'd wear it all summer because like I love like a pop of pink, I love a pop of color. And I just like have it. And also it's because there's no security at the top. And like, yeah, you wear it under like this. So I guess it really doesn't matter. I just like haven't gotten good use out of it. I'm back from the Barbie pop-up, but I just got a package from Salty Face. I ordered this. This tanning water is so good. Macy told me about it, but sometimes it works like amazing on me. And then other times like I must be doing something to make it different. Oh, wait, okay. You know what? Shoot. I think I threw away the top that makes it a spray which I love the spray, so that sucks. 
But I'm gonna try this tanning foam. It looks amazing. Maisie said great things about it. I'm gonna do it tomorrow night because I decided I'm staying in tomorrow night because I've got a big weekend. So anyways, love Salty Face. I think Macy has a code. It might be Macy, not really sure, but really recommend. I'm home from the Barbie pop-up. It's really cute. I think it's going until, I think the end of this month, I think the end of September. I cannot believe, well, today's August 31st. Tomorrow, September. But it is a little bit crazy because I need health insurance and I have got to figure that one out. I'm gonna do a massive closet declutter tonight. I'm hoping to have like two large bags of clothes to donate or whatever. Um, I just need to, and with fall coming, I've decided it's happening tonight in this closet. Guys, let me just show you. This stuff is just crazy because I have to film a haul tomorrow and then I have stuff that I'm giving away. And here is where it's really out of control. I have so much outerwear that just like, it's it's too much. It is too much. And then I have my sweaters and stuff here. And like, this just gives me anxiety. So I don't even know how I'll get to that tonight, but like at least I'll get to all of this stuff. That's just like extra or whatever in the drawers. The drawers I really need to do. So we're gonna see. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call some people, you know, get some entertainment. See how long this lasts. I've already like been going through shoes and like putting stuff over. That's why this is like emptier. Um, and I have like new Sam Adelman fall shoes coming. I love Sam Adelman shoes. So it's just like, I don't know. Like I never wear. Oh wait, no, these are kitten heels. So I'll keep. I just like never wear certain heels, but it's like, then when you need a pair of white heels, you get, you know what I mean? Like I need to keep them. So that's planned. And also like the hats back there are driving me insane. I've got to like figure that out too. Like. There's just a lot going on. Okay, good morning y'all. It's Friday, which means it is the day that we're announcing that we're closing the Okine and I'm starting my own brand. So lots of stuff to do today and I also have so much filming. I left pretty much every like brand deal this week that I need to film today because I'm getting a blowout. So um, it's like 7.30, I just got dressed. I'm wearing this onesie. I'm pretty sure this is from Girlfriend Collective. Um, my New Balance sneakers, sorry, I don't even know. Wayfair, my accent pillow is out for delivery. It's crazy, so much of this has already been delivered. My mattress has come today. But I need to move a couple things in that room. Like that's another thing I've got to do. I've decided to cancel my plans tonight. It's Friday. I'm not doing anything because this weekend we're going to Fort Worth all day tomorrow. I'm going to a TCU game. Then we have like something with the drover. And then um, Sunday I have family stuff. And then Monday is Labor Day. But I need to work because the next day we launch the recipe journals. So um, I need to stay home tonight and edit because I just have a lot of work to do. So you guys are going to be with me. With me as opposed to where else would you be? Anyways, um, time to make some coffee. Also though, when I was cleaning up my closet, oh, new hat of the day, this is Stony Clover, isn't it so cute? When I was cleaning up my closet, I realized I have so many more hats than I thought, and I even donate, I'm gonna donate a ton. These are my current faves. This is from our merch collection. Speaking of, our Texas t-shirts, I have just, I try to keep them up here. I don't know why, I just do. Um, they're still available, so check them out. They've been selling like crazy though, so thanks guys. Oh wait, hold on. So yeah, I don't have the best place to have these, but I have my bro winning housewife hats, clothes over bros, Land Rover, Texas Women's Club, Diamond Cross Ranch, the Budweiser hat that I bought and haven't even worn. I forgot that I had it because they're just not like, if I can't see something in my closet, I will just never wear it. Got a whole like big trash bag full of stuff yesterday. I went through my closet. It still doesn't feel super organized, but honestly, I got rid of a lot of stuff. I really, with sweaters especially, I'm like such a sweaters girl. This fall, I wanna just go through and only have like quality sweaters. The issue is that I have like so many different kinds of each sweater. And I do have like some nice ones, but I just wanna start building that collection because those are things that I will keep literally forever. I'm back home, I got my blowout. So much better, I feel like a new woman. I'm about to get ready, I need to shower and then I'm gonna get ready with y'all 
with some new makeup products. I ordered the Mendocino salad again. I've gotten it, I think, every day this week for lunch. Mendocino Farms is my favorite lunch place ever. I need to get scissors. Okay, and light my fall candle. So, I'm so hungry. Oh, I announced that we're closing the Okine and starting a friend of mine. I'm sure you guys have seen it everywhere now, but the response is so good so far. Thank God. I mean, not that I thought it wouldn't be good, but like, I don't know. It's always like nerve wracking, you know? So thanks guys. Um, but my pillow came in. All of my stuff for this new room is coming in. Apparently the wallpaper is getting delivered. Like this room literally might be done by like next Friday. And I ordered everything this week. Like it's for sure done week after the next. So that's really wild. I'm gonna start moving stuff out later tonight. Just get the room like clean. But it's kind of crazy. Finished all of my filming for the day. I have a lot of editing. I'm staying in as you guys know. I'm trying to get this set up. Um, I'm stepping out of the house very quickly because Macy needs me to go to Tacoma's with her. She's just doing a return. But I love my outfit. My top is Princess Polly. Belt, I think, is Amazon. These are my favorite jeans from Abercrombie. The only thing about them is that they stretch fast, but they are the best. And then my Annie's, which are Jacoba boots. This is just like such a me fit. I'm obsessed. It is 7 p.m. Um, I'm back home. We ended up getting a little happy hour at Barcelona Wine Bar, which is like right by the Chicovas on Alt and It's so good. Um, they have really good marks randomly. But anyways, I am outside getting some work done and my laptop just died. So I'm gonna go in and charge that and hopefully go to bed by like 9 p.m. because we have a like really early morning and college football is back tomorrow. It's just like a whole thing. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Be sure to check out Princess Polly. I love y'all so much, and I'll talk to you soon. What do you think Magnolia's impression of you would be if she just met you? Oh, God. I think she'd be like, who's this weird, like, old version of me? Yeah, it's in a suburban life. She's, like, seeing into the future. She's like, if that's like, that's me if I, like, get my life together. Yeah. Or if I don't. If I, if I lose all my money and I... <laughs>